Livy ab Urba Condita, Book 1, Episode 13. Citus est quemcumque eum dici ius fasque est supernumicum flumen, ioem indigitem appellant. The subject of situs est here is Aeneas from the previous portion, the previous sentence. Aeneas is situated, he is placed, situs est, quemcumque whatsoever him to be called ius fasque est, it is lawful and right. He is situated super numicum flumen near the Numicius River. So we have here ius and fos, whatsoever quemcumque, masculine singular and accusative, accusative because it is the subject of dici, and dici is an infinitive. It's a passive infinitive, present passive infinitive from dico dicere, which is a third conjugation verb. So he is placed, and who is it? Whatsoever or whoever it is right and proper that he be called. In other words, shall we call him Aeneas? Well, he's going to tell us in a minute that actually Aeneas took on the name Jove or Jupiter Indiges. So he is placed, whatever it is right and proper to call him, he's placed super numicum flumen, next to the Numicius River. The identification of this particular river in Italy has proven very, very difficult. But numicum, numicum excuse me, flumen is neuter, singular, and accusative as the object of the preposition super. They call him Appellant, here's the third plural anonymous they. They call him, meaning Aeneas, Jupiter, Yoem, Indigitem. Yoem is the masculine singular accusative. The nominative is Jupiter, like this spelled with one P or sometimes with two. They call him Jupiter Indiges. That means he's the tutelary or the patron deity. He had an apotheosis upon his death. That is, Aeneas was raised to the level of a divinity. It was apotheosized. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the lesson, please press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment.